Hey guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91, and I'm talking about a possible upcoming PlayStation handheld. Now, let me just say, take all of this with a massive grain of salt, because this is not even, a, like, I'm not even sure, this is probably rumor stage more so. It's reported by apparently Insider Gaming, and seemingly the code name is Q Light. But here's where it confuses me. According to the article, it says it will require the PS5. What does that mean? It goes on to say it's set to use Sony's existing remote play functionality to adaptively stream gameplay to the Q-Lite up to 1080p, 60fps. Okay, that's fine. Like, you don't really need more than that for a handheld. But, guys, what exactly do you think it means? Like, you require PS5, so this somehow links to your console? I don't get it. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. Why would they sell a handheld? Unless this is super duper cheap. Like, for example, if it's like um, $199, right? Then it kind of makes sense. But if this is like around like $299 or more, then I don't think this would sell very well. But I don't know. Like, we don't even know if this is coming out. But if this does come out, apparently it's supposed to have like 8-inch LCD touchscreen in the center and stuff. And if... I guess if you're connected to your PS5, you're most likely able to play all the games on your PS5 on this. So, so apparently it's going to be built around cloud streaming, so... I don't know whether that's just through the service. I don't know whether you'll be able to, like, download games to it. Perhaps you'll just be able to play the games you own, but through the cloud. I don't know. And if they have a good enough, you know, cloud service, then... And if they allow it so that you don't need super-duper high internet, then it may work out. But this whole requirement to have the PS5... That's just weird to me. Even if it is just like, an, I don't know, remote play, I guess. I, they have Sony's existing remote play functionality, they said. But that's just weird to me because what if people want to buy this by itself? I mean, I feel like it would, even if they're playing PS5 games, it would make more sense for Sony to sell these as separate things, not require a PS5. But hey, maybe it'll work out. Who knows? It's good to see Sony getting back in the handheld market, if this is true, that is. Because, you know... The Nintendo Switch basically continues to prove that the handheld market is still a pretty big market. What do you guys think about this rumored PlayStation handheld? Co uh, seemingly codenamed the Q-Lite. Let me know in the comments below. And what do you guys think they mean when they said it will require a PS5? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.